guys, way up at Angela Yee. I'm Angela Yee. Jasmine is here. Yes, I'm here. Mano is here. Yep. We're eating these cheese. It's puffed, <laughs> puffy and airy. No, these not the puffed. These ones. not the puffed. It, it just says say it. it. But look at the front oh, of the box. Yeah. Not, oh, yeah. these are whole grain. Yeah, whole yeah these grain. are healthier cheese. Yeah, okay. These. The right ones. <laughs> we have all kind of Cheez-Its. When did they start branching out like this? We need to try the puff ones, though, for real. No. No? Okay. All right, all right well, let's get into this Yee Tea. <laughs> now, Drake, you know, has been on this tour. Mm -hmm. I actually went to the show on Friday, and then I think he's at the Garden this week, right? Okay. Um, so, this was a huge deal for On the Radar. They have a Drake and Central Sea freestyle. Here's a piece of that. You want to know the real me, girl, so you want to see deep inside. Okay. All right. Shout out to Gabe P. He's mm -hmm. up here, too. Also for that on the radar freestyle. I like that. Where he actually um, has been getting some great freestyles for that platform. Central C was up there, too. I yeah, like Central guy. C. He's yeah. from the UK, right? Yeah, yeah. That's dope. All right. And if you people are mad at Drake for certain things right now. Elliot Wilson also called Drake out for only doing interviews outside of, quote, our culture. Okay. All right. So he had said, moment of clarity, no disrespect to Little Boat. Yachty's combo with the boy was comfy and had some cool moments. I was more so clowning the comedy shenanigans with outsiders to our culture. It would be great to hear Drake speak to us again, even if it ain't me. Mm. And, you know, Drake did do a really big sit-down interview with Elliot and B-Dot. Yeah, I remember, right. I remember that. Yeah, I remember that. That was like four years ago. It has over 18 million views, by the way. Mm -hmm. So that was big. But was Elliot, that long ago? Yeah. It was, a, it was a while ago. It was a while ago. So now Drake, as you know, because Drake is petty, he went <laughs> back at uh, Elliot Wilson. Academics had put up a clip on Instagram of Elliot interviewing uh, Trippy Red at Rolling Loud Miami. Mm -hmm. And then Drake said, LOL, man, ish shall not come into his platform for a second time. And now Elliot, 10 toes doing Yes Jules run up interviews at Rolling Loud. Hmm. Just admit the youth took over, big dog. Yes Jules is called a stray. <laughs> yeah. Right, right. Sheesh. Yes, Jules, run up interviews. I did watch uh, Drake's recent um, interview with that chick, Bobby. Mm -hmm. It was funny. Yeah. You can't pronounce her last name. Bobby That's why I just Althoff? pointed to it. Yeah, you didn't even How do you try. say it? I think it's Althoff. Alt I don't know. She's very sarcastic. Althoff. Althoff. Okay, no one can say it properly, probably. Okay. <laughs> All right. So, I mean, you know, I guess she's a huge TikTok uh, star, has a huge following there, and it was a different type of interview. Right. And people got some moments from it, and it had some funny moments. Yeah, I think Elliot. And it it be, was random. It did. I think Elliot going. feels feels away when he when certain people don't come to his platform. But he did also. Here's the thing: you also did have a huge interview with him. A huge right. sit down. He won another one. Big numbers. <laughs> he wants another one. How many do you think you're going to get? I don't know. I, I guess you're just getting one. <laughs> one and, one said, and done, man. Good. Elliot did say even if it's not with him. Yes. Yeah, he yeah, wants yeah. To, he wants to see it done. And you can't blame Elliot for one another Drake interview. Right. Yeah, like, oh, now you're not coming to me? <laughs> but he said not even just him. Yeah, you yeah, know, yeah. So. All right, now Monica has, issu has issued an apology, which I don't think she needed to do. Mm -hmm. But she was in Detroit at a concert, and she jumped into the crowd to confront a man who she says hit a woman during her concert there. Mm. Here's some of the audio of what was going on while she was on stage, and she saw this happen. <laughs> Well. She said, you don't hit an effing lady like that. That's and right. she actually got off the stage, went into the crowd, and walked up to the person and addressed him again. Mm -hmm. And then Monica left a comment on the shade room. I apologize there, and I'm apologizing here for my actions. But no one would take action. I was so triggered, I watched, and she didn't appear to even know him. It appeared to be about space. During a packed concert, he punched her with all his strength. My intentions were to prevent her from being hit again, and she wasn't. I asked for help. It fell on deaf ears. And she said, the woman is 50 plus. Oh, no. no. I mean, listen. No apology necessary. Right. right. Yes. We don't even want your apology. We like that you stood up and, and did what you did. It is what it is. Sometimes it bothers you me that nobody something. did anything. Right. Though. She called it out on stage. That's crazy. And the fact that that's crazy that's to disgusting. me. That's disgusting. Yeah. All right. Well, that is your Yee-T. And when we come back, we have Under the Radar. These are the stories that are not necessarily front page news. They are flying under the radar. But we still know that they are very important for you guys to know about. One of them definitely affected me directly. Okay, it's way up with Angela Yee. <laughs>